A high energy opening day to the West Indies Full Boy Shooting Championships out at Tucker Valley Rifle Range in Chagaramas. And as we hear from Ruskin Mark, teams from Canada and the UK are here to compete with and against the region's best. This is, this is a wonderful tournament because it caters for people of various grades and it's competitive but it's not aggressively competitive and all the other competitors are such nice people and so easy to get on with. An obvious fan of coming to Trinidad Tobago who has taken advantage of the chance to come back to a place he fell in love with since he first arrived here as a student back in 1964 and this time he hopes to take the title while making new acquaintances. But Team TNT is also keen on doing well, as they look to lift the title once again, not having done so in recent years after lifting the crown on six or seven occasions in the past. We certainly have won it. But in recent history, the Guyanese by far have outperformed us. Last year, the Barbadians won. Trinidad came second. This year, we are hoping uh, to come first. The competitors were encouraged to not just compete well, but to take the time to enjoy a bit of the world-famous TNT hospitality and cuisine. Seven countries, namely Antigua, ba Barbados, Bermuda, Canada, England, Guyana, and of course, host Trinidad and Tobago will participate in the 2019 edition of the West Indies Football Rifle Championship. Approximately 80 participants are expected to vie for prizes of various categories throughout the competition. I am pleased that members of the Trinidad and Tobago Defense Force were given the opportunity to participate and compete alongside our security agencies and civilian organizations locally, regionally, and internationally. He would start the ball rolling by firing the ceremonial first shot to officially launch the competition. And the competitors wasted little time in getting to work as they tried to rack up points. The individual competition runs through Friday and will be followed by the team event on Saturday, the final day of competition. First time in this competition in this region, and surely not the last, innovative technology will be introduced through the use of electronic targets for participants to apply fire. And it will also be the platform for which Scores will be collated and tallied. Members of the TNT Defence Force, Police Service and the TNT Cadets will also be among the participants hoping to show off their capabilities as marksmen. We can only wish them well. Ruskin Mark, TDT Sports.